the middle first. Go ahead. Yes, that's you, sir. Oh, I just want to say that in terms of the Australia invaded uh, Iraq for non-compliance with the United Nations resolutions, and here we are throwing United Nations resolutions again uh, in terms of the East Jerusalem and the occupied territories, and we call them disputed. We changed that, and so we're not actually recognizing United Nations resolutions anymore. Let's hear from our other panelists here, and I'll start with Virasila and then I'll go to James. How, how are you listening to this argument? Does it make sense to you, first of all? Um, well, yeah, not really. Because I'm, <laughs> I'm just thinking to myself, I mean, these words occupied, disputed. I mean, the people of the First Nation of Australia would, you know, call um, Caucasian Australians as occupying um, Australia. I mean, is how do you, I mean, why, why is this definition being, this difference being made? Um, I mean, what is, what is your definition of occupied and what is your definition of disputed? I mean, yeah, that, that's what I'm curious about. We'll throw about. that in as a rhetorical question and we'll go to James. Well, you're going to like this. I agree with about 95% of what Ed said, actually, but I'd like to put it into context for you. Israel is the only democracy in a sea of awful places in the Middle East, and I mean awful. Not only, hang on, not only is it a democracy, Palestinians in Israel do better than they do in, just be quiet, will you? They do better, they do better than a lot of other places. And... In the last, I don't know, two or three attempts at peace, basically all of the West Bank has been offered, and it's just seemingly that that's not enough, and a lot of these countries don't even recognize Israel. So in that context, you know, Israel gets judged by pretty harsh standards. They don't get, they don't get judged by anywhere near the same standards as, shall we start, you know, Libya, Syria, Iraq, Iran, um, even Jordan. So... In that context, we are very hard on Israel. And if you want an example of that, the United Nations Human Rights Council, which is the leading human rights council for the entire world, makes resolutions and they condemn you know, various countries for human James, rights. James, we're, we're going to run out Hang of time. On, no, I'm no, 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 I'm not. There have been, more, only interrupting there have been you. more resolutions against Israel than every other country on earth put together. James, I'm just going to bring you back to You said you agreed with a lot of what Ed said. He, he's right. I wouldn't be changing the wording myself. He's totally right. So on the question of occupied and disputed, you would leave it at occupied. I don't, I don't see what you got. I don't okay, see what we've you got get. one more uh, person.